Hey guys, Coach Cam here. Got your workout for Monday, June 1st. Can't believe we're already into June. This is pretty crazy. Hope you all are being safe out there. So for today's workout, we've got three different AMRAPs, all are six minutes long, uh, and they're broken down with some rest in between. So AMRAP number one is six minutes, and you'll do a 200 meter run, followed by 20 air squats. Then you'll rest two minutes at the end of that six minutes. The next AMRAP, again, is six minutes long. You'll still do 200 meter run, then you'll do 15 push-ups, body weight only, and then you'll again rest two minutes between uh, after that AMRAP, and then one more six-minute AMRAP with again a 200-meter jog, and then 10 either pull-ups, 10 table rows, 10 bent over rows with an odd object or a dumbbell. We want you doing some sort of uh, uh, pulling motion for 10 reps, and you'll do that for six minutes, and then the workout is done. If you do have a vest at home, a weighted vest, let's wear that. It makes the, uh, the running and the body weight movements a little spicier. Uh, and then of course you can incorporate uh, really anything like that into it. Okay, let's break down some of the movements in today's workout. So the run is pretty straightforward. Pick a distance, whether you use an app on your phone or a distance on your street, you can run. That's about 200 meters long. And just pace yourself. Try to breathe through it. It's, uh, it's conversation pace, uh, should be pretty easy. If running is something you're still working on, we can do 90 seconds of just high knees instead of the run. For the air squat, we go over this all the time uh, in classes and I've done it for um, many workouts over the last few weeks. We just want you to get below parallel while trying to keep your chest up. So you can have your hands in front of you to help that if you want, but let's get lower than our hip crease and then stand at the top. For the push up, let's try and stay as, as tight as we can as we go all the way to the bottom, letting our chest and our thighs, uh, thighs hit the ground and then coming up to the top for full arm extension. And then lastly, the pull up. If you're doing pull ups or you have a pull up bar, uh, or the edge uh, of a deck or some object. Let's make sure we get our chins over top of our, our where our hands are. Doing a table row, there's tons of uh, resources on the online, on YouTube to show you different versions of that, even hanging uh, sheets in the creases of doors to do some sort of a, an upright row, that's okay as well. Of course, you could also do a dumbbell or odd object row where you're kind of, you're standing, you're bent over, and you just want you to pull that object as close to your chest as you can, squeezing your back. Okay, so for the warm up today, we're gonna put five minutes on the clock, and we're just gonna send a cycle through some easy stuff. You'll do a 100 meter jog, uh, 10 air squats, and then five burpees, and you just go through that nice and slow to get warm for five minutes. Okay, everyone, that's your workout for today. Uh, have a great workout, make sure you're all being safe. When you're done your workout, make sure you record your scores, post on either Instagram, there's comments on YouTube, even on our own website, of course. And uh, if you do have any questions about any of the movements, if you wanna make it easier, make it harder, reach out to your home coach. We're here to help. Uh, we're here to support you. So uh, hope, again, hope you're being safe and we will see you shortly. Cheers.